Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to show you how to add items into Terraria 1.3 mobile that you never had before. That you just like spawn them in. You can choose the amount of that item that you want to add to your inventory. Uh, originally, I was going to make a video like this using Game Guardian, but Game Guardian requires root. I know a lot of you don't have root. The process is a little more advanced and I just I figured I'd show you an easier way it does the exact same thing uh, first I'm gonna make a new character Yeah, that'll work. Now this new character will have three items. A copper axe, a copper pickaxe, and a copper sword. I'll show you that there's nothing in my inventory except for these three items that you start with. We're going to add some items. All you need is a web browser. I use Firefox, but you can use your built in web browser, Chrome, or whatever you have. I'll post the links to these websites, but the, the website with the tool here it is TerraSaver. It's like an online tool to edit your character's information or edit its inventory. Before you do this, you might want to back up your character's file with your file explorer. Your character file is located in internal storage. I'm on Android. You can do this on uh, iPhone as well. On Android, it's uh, in Android data com dot and dot games five oh five Terraria right here. Then players, and right here, mullet giraffe dot plr. You can uh, copy that somewhere, like downloads or something paste it. Oh, I did that earlier. And you'll have that backed up in case you mess up your player's profile or your player save. But you don't have to do that if you don't really care if it's a new character or whatever. And, uh, so you go to Firefox or to your web browser and you click up here in the corner where it's yellow load player. And then you go to the same place where your player file is at. I'll open my file explorer. Then go to Android. Data. Terraria. Players. And then pick the player you want to edit. Mullet Giraffe. Oh, that didn't work. There. file away I guess <clears throat> there's my player that I made earlier then there's a tab up here that says inventory after character equips misc it says inventory and that shows what's in your character's inventory you pick a space 
and then over here it says name, index, count, prefix. Like if I click one of these items, like the X, it shows the name, index, that's the item ID number. If you already have an item on count, you can click on it. Count. It's a little buggy. Sometimes it won't let you like click on it and edit. I'm going to put 999. Uh, didn't hit the I'm gonna refresh it it's a little hard on a phone it's meant for a computer but Nine nine nine, and then enter. It changed it to nine hundred ninety nine. If you want to spawn in something, click an empty space. And if you don't know the item idea of the item you want, you can go to this other website. I will post the link to it too. It has all these item IDs. You can get any of these items. I don't remember what the Terra Blade is. Seven something. Right there it is. Seven fifty seven Terra Blade. So you use that item ID uh, seven fifty seven. And that blank spot that you pick, type it into index, 757. Now we have a terror blade there, but a count of zero. And then you change the count if it's not being buggy, like mine is. Get my keyboard to pop up. Of course this would happen when I'm trying to make a video. Oh, that works. <laughs> 757 Terra Blades. And then up here in green you can hit Save Player. It saved it as Mollet Draft 2 in parentheses because I already had a file in that folder with a play that player name. It didn't overwrite it. So you go back to where your player is at. Android, data, players. I think I might have overwrote it in the... Oh, here it is. I made a second one in my download folder where I backed it up. I'm going to rename that. That won't let me. I'll delete this. Then I'll copy that. And overwrite the one in my player folder. Overwrite. So now I put the new player that I just edited in my player folder. I'm going to close Terraria. 
open it again. There, I have 757 Terra Blades. It's a little buggy using the online tool, trying to get your keyboard to pop up and stuff, but it's way easier than using Game Guardian. If you guys do want me to show you how to use Game Guardian to do it, I'll do a video of that. Just leave a comment. Or if you have any questions, you can ask me on the comments. I'll try to help out. I'm not on here very often, but there you go. A pretty easy way to do it without installing anything. I'll try to make some new videos with some other interesting stuff if you guys want me to. Uh, you guys have a nice day. Thanks for watching.